hearing, uh, as we expected, some of the horrible conditions, the psychological torture that these these uh, hostages underwent. Uh, one hostage said that uh, you know that he he was told day after day that Israel no longer existed, that there'd been you know a massive attack, uh, that no one was coming to get him, that you know they were going to be uh, forever uh, now in the Gaza Strip. Uh, others had their children taken away from them for periods of time where they feared they were dead. And now we're hearing also, you know, some of the worst fears, the physical abuse, the sexual assault. Um, there's a psychologist who says several uh, of the hostages were sexually abused. Even one hostage now coming uh, forward and saying that uh, other hostages told her while they were in captivity that they were sexually assaulted. Uh, she counts at least three, um, you know, and this is backed up even by some of the doctors who off the record told major news organizations that at least 10 of the hostages that had been, uh, you know, um, had been had been uh, treated, that at least 10 of them had been sexually assaulted. And in that group were not only uh, women, but men.